Personally, if you asked me, what are the three greatest objects of design? The wall unit would be in that three. What's compelling about Braun is that the ethos of the company is about function and aesthetic and all things combined. And so these beautifully designed objects still work is a metaphor about what design can do for our lives. Between functional purpose and artistic quality, you know, there's a range of sensibilities. The showcase is to us that like mundane objects can have an artistic quality if considered. That function and art may or may not exist on a parallel path, they can interact, but they help us understand an object. You know, I'm very much intrigued by what deems itself as art or artistic. I think the wall unit has always existed to me as this amazing way to look at sound. So just as an object itself, it's, it always strikes me as leaning towards a work of art by it being mounted on a wall. Is this a compelling object of design? So I look at design icons, you know, an Air Force One as an iconic object just the same way as the Braun wall unit. You know, what's like a Brazilian soul sample to Jay Dilla? Why can't that exist in the space of these canonized objects? And what does it look like? When studying the wall unit and seeing how to sort of bring it into modern times because it's such a timeless object, transforming the object into all chrome, I thought, heightened its experience. But also, chrome has like a long history within the black canon of aesthetics, whether that's, you know, platinum chains or gold teeth. There's that shine that heightens importance. So all those worlds combined you know, these are just man-made materials and they all have a meaning and subcontext based on who uses it and how it's used. Very much as the metaphor of, you know, Mies chrome columns in the Barcelona Pavilion or Paul Wall's wheels. There's a interesting intersection if both are contemplated. And that's very much what my practice is about, crisscrossing those two paths. Working with pieces from the archive to relate to a culture that didn't exist when those items were originally made is profound. It's reaching new generations just by forward-thinking ideas. The final result that we've developed in partnership with the Brown team is are deep within the ethos of Brown to build things to last, to truly be timeless while allowing new stories to be told. We all make stuff. The goal is to make it with purpose. 